one of the big questions that we have in this field of race or ancestry is how to actually categorize the different groups. Because there's got to be some way to categorize and put people together. Like which people are part of the same group. You know, look around the room, and I see people, and they kind of look similar, but they're different. But it's, kinda, it's pretty clear that some people belong to certain groups. But who? What? How? This is a really big question. So we're, I'm going to demonstrate. We're going to do an activity, and I'm going to demonstrate how difficult this can be. So what I need is a person in the class who has the highest GPA. And you have to be at least a junior for this. Who, does anyone have a 4.0? Dude, anyone have a 4.0? Seriously, nobody has a 4.0? Are there any sophomores who have a 4.0? Really? How about like a 3.9 or 3.8? Do you have a 3.9? Which? Yeah? All right, come down. All right. Everyone. And what's your name, bro? Uh, Creed. What is it? Creed. Creed? C-R-E-E-D. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah. Damn, dude. All right. Yeah. Creed and Creed, not only do you have a cool name, but you have an earring. So. Yeah. And yes, I do. what's your background? Uh, what, like, major? Or? No. Well, what's your major? Oh, aerospace engineering. Aerospace. Yeah. <laughs> dude. All right. <laughs> All right. Dude, listen, man. It's not such a big deal. Now, if you were a sociology major with a 3.9, I'd think that was impressive. But <laughs> aerospace, whatever. Anybody can do Sam. that. Anyone. All right. Sam. Anyone yeah, make sure you hold the mic close. Oh, sorry. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Bro, you, you're going to... Do you think... So you're, sm you're a smart dude. In some ways, yes. And then engineering. So you're pretty yeah. smart at categories and so on sure. and so forth? Yeah. All right, bro. So can I have my volunteers, all the folks who I've, no, not you, bro. That, everyone who I talked to before class, can you come down? Yep. All right, bro. So you can stand, stand out here. And I want you all to line up right here. And Jay, you're going to need to come down here. Dude, can you really fast, can you just do me a favor? Can you take him back there real fast? Bro, come back here. Sure. Real fast. Just, no, just make sure you can. Hey, is there anybody in here? So I picked the, real fast, I picked these folks out before class, but is there anybody in here who's got a background that, that you'd never guess in a million years? Bro, you? What's your background? What is it? Wait, hang on. Russian? Russian? I don't know. I would have guessed that, dude. Dude, you? What is it? What? Oh, yeah. All right, you. Blunt, blunt. What's yours? Not, not that it's not, dude. I really wouldn't have guessed you're Russian, but, you know, it's not what I need. What's yours? No, no, hang on. What's yours, bro? All right, dude. Come here real fast. All right, here we go. All right. Can you get him? So you got to. So can you get close up on their faces? All right, can you put, Jeff, I need the, um, I need this on. Jumbotron. Can you, so get there. Bro, you got to come out here, bro. Oh, okay. Your job is to put them into categories as quickly as possible, meaning that you got to decide what ancestry groups go together, what people are with which ancestry groups. Like, do these, do these four people or this guy oh, and this guy no. and this guy, whoever, like put them into <laughs> groups. You can have as many groups as you want. You can't have that many groups, but you can have as many as you want or as few as you want, but they got to go together and they got to make sense. And then Jiggy is going to follow you up and see if she can best you. All right. Okay. Um, you too. Y'all uh, clap for him before. We'll see if he really this is. This is going to be terrible. Um... You can you, you make sure can you make sure you focus in on different faces? You are all in one group. Go ahead, you can um, move people. No, you gotta move them around. Oh, you gotta so move. You two go over here. 
there. Okay. Um, you. You and you, I think, are in another group. Um, oh yeah, dude, you're you're killing it, dude. <laughs> uh, one, two, three, four in another group, and then you and you and you are in another group. Oh, dude, you're killing it, dog. <laughs> You're dying, actually. I, I don't know. Okay, so wait. You got one group here. Okay. One group. This is a group? Yes. And th where's your group here? It's four. These four and these three? Yeah, I did, like, hue. <laughs> Skin tone, I guess. That was the best <laughs> way I could do it. Did. <laughs> I, if I were you, I'd look at their noses also, actually. Ooh. But that's all right. Jiggy, are you, uh, you, you got yours now? You got to get a close-up look, man. Figure out where you're going to go. No, go ahead. Keep going. You, keep going. Okay. You might want to go beyond skin tone, bro, because okay, skin sorry. tone is uh, like not. Uh, noses. <laughs> go. You can leave it. We're good. Dude, you're 3.9, bro. You got nothing to yeah, apologize for. I don't know. For. I'm just, I'm seeing, there's something I'm not seeing. Just between your name and the earring, bro. <laughs> yeah. You got it. All right, Jig Dog, you ready? Where would you go? Creed. Really? How'd they? Go ahead. Go move pe folks around. What is, uh, where'd you get the name Creed, by the way? Uh, my mom said it's like some character on House on the Ferry, but I think she just really liked Apollo Creed. I think oh, yeah? I think she's a big fan <laughs> of it. That did. All right. I like that. Did you get everybody? Gee, where would you go? Who would you move? I'm going to be so hard, and then I'm going to be so wrong, and then it's just going to be embarrassing. Um, 30 seconds. Yo, 30 seconds. Give me, give me time. Okay, I, I don't think you're in this group, so just. She's not in that group? No, I don't think so. Just. Create a divide here. I'm Moses. You're all on, you're uh, all by your lonesome there. Don't feel bad. I don't think you're in this group, so I want us to get a divide. No, you're right here. I'm gonna step one over. I feel like I I feel like you're on your own. Uh. <laughs> This, this dude right here? This guy? He, he, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I think you... Uh, I think you two might go over there. Those two go over there? Yeah. All right, hang on, hang ah. on. Let's stay right there for now. <laughs> so, all right. With where? With these two? Mm-hmm. All right, okay. Dude, she might have you right there, Creed. I'm telling you. I don't know. I'm just saying. All right, let me see. Is that it? Those three crackers at the end, they're all the same? I didn't say that. All right. I don't think she belongs in that group either. But you don't think she belongs maybe, here? Maybe we'll see. Yeah? Yeah. Dude, oh, well, come down at the end. Come down here at the end. All right, all man, right. let's go. Let's, let's, start, let's start right here. All right, <laughs> your name and where you're from and what's your background? Um, my name's Jessica. Hold it, hold it really t close. My name is Jessica. Um, I'm from like Lancaster County. Yo, hang on. Say that. Listen to her. Say it again. You ready, bro? <laughs> you might want to change it. Listen to how she talks. Say it again, real loud. My name's Jessica. I'm from Lancaster County. You want to keep her there? Is she there? Is she white, bro? I don't know, man. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I mean, like, I guess what's, what's that? on the outside and what's on the inside is different. I just could only see and a minute what was on the outside. All right. So what's your ancestry? Um, I'm all breeds of white, unfortunately. <laughs> You're so, white? Yeah. Unfortunately? Well, Dog, you <laughs> dissing us like that? Come on, man. Well, because I don't like the standards that other white people create for people that don't believe in those standards. Like happiness? Sure. Yeah, all right. <laughs> all right, I got you. Look, so let me tell you something, though. Black and brown people, they create some pretty messed up standards, too, man. I just want us to put that out there, dog. Okay. All right. Not that I ever notice, but all right. Okay, good. So you're white. 
Bro, what's your name, background? Uh, my name is Fati, and I'm from North Philly. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm actually Middle Eastern, half Turkish, half Albanian. Half Turkish, half, half Albanian? So you're like kind of Southern Europe, but which side of Turkey, which, ti- which side of the Bosphora is, is your family on? Uh, the West Asian side. side? What's that? The what? European the w- side. European West side? side? Yeah. All right. Bro. So he's European, but kind of not. What's your, what's your ancestry besides white? Just white? Uh, Italian. Italian? All right, bro. Uh, I'm Austin. I'm from Pittsburgh. <laughs> Yo, all right. Come on, dog. Go ahead. Uh, I'm Hispanic. What's your Hispanic? Uh, like Dominican Republic, Puerto Rico. From the DR in Puerto Rico? All right, man. All right, here we go. Wait, so, Jiggy. Is she, so she's together, right? Is she together? No, she's not. Broke, go ahead. My name's Joanna, I'm from Pittsburgh. Yeah. And I'm German and Croatian. German and Croatian? All right, so kind of close to you, bro. All right, so you're white. Yes? Um, I'm Sadeha and I'm from Pakistan. From Pakistan, so bro, listen, German and Croatia and Pakistan, they go together. If any two people go together, they are clearly one ancestry group, no doubt about that. All right, what's your name again? Sariha. okay. I'm David, uh, I'm from Wisconsin, and my dad is a Russian Jew, and my mom is uh, of Indian ancestry. Russian Jew and yeah. Indian. Yeah. So you, you're next to the Pakistani, because it's the same country, India and Pakistan, right? Isn't it? Isn't they it were. the same country, y'all? <laughs> I mean, you're like fighting over stuff, but come on, it's the same thing. All right, come on, whatever. All right, bro. Wait, so you, you were, these three were together, bro. You failed miserably. Technically, India and Pakistan were together. They like, were indeed. Okay. No, but they had them together. That's fine. No, they go together. They really do. I'm just joking. All right, bro. Uh, my name is Manuel, and I'm from Colombia. Manuel from Colombia. Okay. You had, did you have them together? Separate. Jiggy, you did? You put these two together? Nice fail, dog. All right. I'm Gabby. I'm from Chester County, and I'm Mexican. Oh, you're Mexican. You're the one that's going to be building the wall, right? Okay. Exactly. Damn. Exactly. Paying y'all for it, see too. that Trump, Trump's going to get that wall built, y'all. We're going to do it. You can do it. Did you, like, jump over the wall to get here? Or are you I like, swam. wait, hang on. Seriously? I actually swam. You swam? You know. Seriously? No. All no. Right. All right. Okay, got it. Okay. Hi, I'm John. Um, I'm from New York. My dad's from. My dad's from where Israel. in New York? Huh? Where's your dad from? Israel, and my mom's from Morocco. From where? Morocco. Morocco. All right, so Israeli, African, Israeli. So that was that's pretty close. You got it. You're close. You got the Colombia, Dominican Republic, and Mexico. oh, Mexico. Ah, same thing, right? All right, and then Israel. Did you have them together? You had them separated. No, I had them together. Oh, dude, rock on. That 3-9 is going to serve you well in the world. All right, bro. All right, go ahead. I'm Anthony. I'm from Pittsburgh. And I'm Afro-Latino and white. Afro-Latino. What's that mean, bro? Uh, I'm Afro-Puerto Rican. So my father, like slaves, went to Puerto Rico as well. So, so is, your de- is your father, your father's African? My father's Afro-Puerto Rican. Yeah, like both dark his, skin? Dark skin, both of his parents. And hair? What's his hair Puerto like? Uh, it's curly. Like, so like curly? Like, 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 like tight kinks? Or? Yeah. Yeah? Tight curls. Like, like, like hers? Dude, how did I know? You knew I was going to pick you. You mean like her hair? No, not like that. Not, not quite. All right, but, all right, because your hair is not. No, my hair is curly. I get blowouts and stuff. So. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Oh, yeah, <laughs> dude, all right. Okay, here we go. Uh, I could have so just showed, I could have gone to her. All right, go ahead. Um, is this on? Can everybody hear me? Hi. Yeah. <laughs> um, my name is Kiara. I'm from Mount Bethel, Pennsylvania. No? Okay. No, all right. <laughs> Enough. Okay, all right, go I ahead. get it. Um, and I'm black. <laughs> dude, yeah. You know what I mean? When I, the moment I saw you, I said, my God, she's got to be a Russian Jew if I ever oh, met yeah, one. totally. And I was totally. so wrong. Bro, so just black, but you're doing an ancestry test, so yeah. you'll find out. Mm-hmm. Okay, so these two are together, bro? Jiggy, you separated them, right? Okay. It, but you, she was on her own. She might be on her own. Okay. My name is Lexi. I'm from Philly. And All right, go ahead. And <laughs> I'm black, Italian, Native American, Irish. 
Black, Italian, Native American, and Irish. So you were good to pull her out, right? However, you, are most, you would be most closely connected, really, to these folks down here. Because you all, you, you in particular, you less so. Because if I, here, can you just, can you, can you see on the Jumbotron his, dude, can you, can you come out here real fast? Which camera is on? Turn to the side. See his nose right here? See that little hump? Can I touch your nose, bro? Yeah, sure. All right. <laughs> see that little bump right there? You got that? Turn your head just like that. Right there. See, see that bump? Dude, that's an Indian nose right there. Right? That's an Indian nose. So you, you, I can, but I don't see it with you. Right? Hang on. Let me look. Nah, I don't see it with you. You got that European thing going on. All right. Thanks, bro. But I don't see it with you either. Right? Yeah, like you said. Okay, bro. Hey, what's up? I'm Isaac. I uh, live in South Florida, and I'm Puerto Rican. Puerto Rican, dude. It's good you had the Puerto Rican next to the Puerto Rican, because that really, they really kind of fit together right there, right? So how, did you have, you didn't have him either. You had, did you have him as Puerto Rican? Did you move him? This guy, the Puerto Rican? You, he's, a, yeah. So you would have moved these two guys, right? Weren't they the two guys you moved? I think so. I think either way, you both failed pretty miserably. Uh, and I think what I see here is, one, one, I think, a, a, a very important lesson in doing this that I think is really important. Whether you're making friends or deciding who to sit with or sit next to on the bus or if you're... Um, hiring people for a job or any number of things. The most important lesson here is you really can't know who people are by looking at them. You really can't. Like, I don't look at you. Do you, do you see that she's, are you, you're basically half white. Do you see that she's half white? Mm, yeah, you'd hesitate, but you're, you got a lot of white in you, dog. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. You don't have much white in you. Do you see, do you see that she's half white? Not necessarily? How about her? Not necessarily? Come on, take a wild guess, dog. Look at you. Seriously? You don't see white blood? I mean that you look at them and say, yeah, yeah, you got white in you, definitely. I don't know where, I don't know how, but you do, right? You can see a mix? Yeah. Definitely compared to you. You're straight up Nigerian? Yeah, all right. Dude, can you just stand up real fast so you can see who I'm talking to? This is the woman who doesn't have any white in her at all, all right, if you hadn't guessed. All right. So, so anyway, but the point is, you can't, we can't know who people are and where they're from. You just don't know. But we do, we make these quick assumptions about people all the time. But who they are and what they are and their backgrounds and all sorts of things. But really, we don't know. Like, I don't know you're Mexican. I have no idea that you're Mexican. And then, but you must get it all the time. People make statements about Mexicans and, and no, nobody knows. Everybody actually thinks I'm either Philippine, Asian, or Hawaiian. Really? Nobody ever guesses Mexican or yeah. like, like Latino. Do, what do people guess for you, bro? Uh, people guess I'm Mexican. Well. They guess you're Mexican? Yeah. Yeah. Colombia, Mexico, it's all good, right? Don't you want to be Mexican now because you got to build a wall and that's not cool. How about you, bro? What do people think that you are? Arab, most Arab? of the time. Yeah. Yeah, Arab Muslim? Yeah. It's the hat, man, and the beard. <laughs> yeah. So the idea, though, is <clears throat> increasingly more and more and more people are going to start to look like this because people are coming together via globalization and movement from all over the world. And people are going to start to have these looks that we really can't categorize. And we don't really know. And we don't understand. And we're all increasingly being brown. And go to the next slide, which I think... Um, can you actually go to the... You know, go one more to... No, go back, go back. Let me show you this. As you, as you all are standing up here, go to the... Go to one more. Go to one more. Yeah, right there. So we're always trying to make these categories, and it can be problematic. Here's one of the first people who did this, Linnaeus. 
1735, he developed three categories. White people, who he, of course he's white, because white people were inventive, sharp, and perspective, and gentle. Because when I think about white people, I think gentle. That's definitely it. <laughs> then they're the dark race and the red race, severe and haughty and covetous and governed by opinions. Right? And black people, indolent or lazy, negligent, crafty, anoints himself with grease. This is what he said. This is part of the racial category, right? Governed by caprice or based on some whims. And so, you know, you're going, if, we, if we're not careful, what, what this can show us is that from the very beginning, when people were trying to categorize people and put them into groups, we categorize the best features for the folks who look like us, of course, because if Linnaeus had been black or brown, then black and brown people would have been on top. But it's white people, so they're the best. They're the smartest and, you know, the, the most perceptive and so on. And so when we're, if we're doing this sort of thing all the time, which we are, we're probably naturally going to take the characteristics that we have and hold those up the highest. And, and we're constantly trying to do it. So here's another one This kind of, well, here's like someone tried with 15 categories. They tried to divide the world up. And what I want to tell you is that there's really, there's no way to divide people up, bro. So there's no set number of categories. You did a nice job, by the way, I got to say. I'm impressed. And G, you did a nice job, too, even though you both failed. But there's no way to divide the world into categories that make complete sense. Like, like uh, Creed said, well, I just use skin tone. Well, okay, use skin tone, but why not use shape of the nose? Or why not use the texture of the hair? Or why not use height, right? Or why not use the eyes? Or why not use the lips? Or use the ears? Or the shape of the mouth? All these things are things that people used to use. Shape of the fingers. Everything that we can imagine people have used to divide the world up into different categories. And you can't do it. And increasingly we're seeing this is impossible because more and more and more people are going to are going to be like you all, right? Like the Moroccan Jewish guy. Who is that? Is that you, bro? Yeah. That was you, right? The Moroccan Jew, right? So like you got it? So as we're continuing on and we're just throwing these ideas about ancestry and race, and remember that we don't really know. We have no idea. We have no idea. Like I know, I don't know how much what blood you have in you, right? What it, what it all is. But it's, and it's cool. It's all good. Are we cool? All right, man. Hey, thanks for participating, you all, right? Thanks. Dude.